Okay, today I'm at the Pearl Hotel Kuala Lumpur. This is the Pearl Hotel Kuala Lumpur Genset room. I'm going to test run the Genset using off-load conditions. Okay, first of all, before we test run the Genset, let's check the parameters as usual. Okay, this is the Genset itself. Okay, this Genset is quite big also and uh, has been almost about 20 over years old. Okay, the KVA of the Genset is 1200 KVA. Okay, first of all, we have the dry cell battery. This is nickel metal hydride. Okay, let's touch the battery, see any overcharge condition or not. Any burn termination, termination tighten. In good condition. Okay, then uh, we have to check the condition of the belting. All right, there's no worn. Uh, let's touch it. Okay, quite tension, no issue. Okay, this is a termination for the starter. No problem. Air filter a bit dirty. Advice to replace air filter for the next servicing. Okay, let's check the other side of the genset. Okay, this is the genset uh, engine oil hose fuel hose and also radiator water hose can be seen here let's check underneath the bottom is there any sign of leakage fuel any sign of leakage engine oil and any sign of leakage radiator water okay so far no problem everything dry it's a good news looking at this genset have been so many years of service last servicing date is 2016 advisable to do servicing uh, because it's more than three years old from the last servicing all right now let's check the radiator water oh. to climb up okay it's quite dry i will there's uh, some water underneath the bottom there okay Let's see how deep. Yeah, there's a little bit of water, but advice to top up. Okay, after checking the radiator water level, do make sure tighten cap properly. And then we go down back. Okay, we are going to trigger this genset to start automatically using the test mode from here okay then we're going to put it back to auto and allow it to stop automatically using the shutdown timer which is set to three minutes all right let's get started okay
Okay, the genset already stopped automatically. After the genset stop, we do make sure the genset battery is being charged by referring to the charging ammeter. Okay, make sure everything back to auto, emergency stop, release. Double check the genset, any physical problem after test run. Everything seems in good condition. Okay. That's all for today. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.